again and welcome back to The Body Coach TV. My name is Joe Wicks and this is day number 20 of my 21 days of strength challenge. The focus today is on chest and shoulders. All you're gonna need is a flat bench and three pairs of dumbbells. A heavy set for some pressing, a sort of medium set for some flies and then finally a light set for some lateral shoulder raises, uh, frontal and lateral. So yeah, three weights. So I'm using 30 kilograms for my heavy press, 16 kilograms for my dumbbell flies and then uh, six kilograms for my, um, my raises. So what we're going to do to begin with is 10 press ups on the floor into 10 heavy dumbbell presses. So we're going to start on the floor. We're going to have a nice and narrow position. So we're not going to go super wide with these. And we're going to tuck those elbows in, press for 10 reps. That's our first exercise. Then we go flat on the bench for 10, if we can, eight to 10 heavy, it's a heavy weight today, heavy uh, dumbbell press. Okay, so 10 push-ups on the bench, 10 um, dumbbell press, and we're going to do three rounds of that. Here we go, first set and 10 slow push-ups. Control the weight, take it easy, slow down, let's go. Okay, so slow reps. One, two, three, get chest to floor if you can, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and ten. X, and that's a nice little way just to sort of weight the chest up a little bit. We're now going to pump out ten heavy, so picking up the dumbbells. I've got 30 kilograms. This is a, this is a big weight. So yeah, eight to ten is the is the, is the kind of rep range I'm looking for. Right. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> so rolling back, pop them up. Right. Here we go. Big push. One. Two. I think eight's my number here. What are these? Six, yeah. Eight's the number. Seven. Last rep. Eight. And relax. Oh. Wow. And just managed that last rep. So yeah, eight. Eight is the number for me with them. Oh, maybe less on the second set. Oh, that's heavy. Right, and also just for those presses, you're not, you're not close like this. You're not flaring out like this. 45 degrees, so just in line with the chest, stretch that chest open. Push directly up so don't end up here. It's easy there, it's on the shoulders. And here, directly on the chest. So stretch 45 degrees there, and then just press up, squeeze, and down. So we're not trying to use our shoulders, because it's easier when you go like that. It's almost like a, it takes the stress off your chest, so you want to keep it in line with the chest. And press up. Ah. Right, so, <clears throat> I'm gonna 10 and eight. You can do eight to 10, it's fine. We're going to go back in for our second set. So a little stretch of the chest. Okay, we're ready. Second set. So narrow push up, military style push ups. Let's go. 10 reps. One. six, I'll be happy. It is a heavy weight, All right? Here we go then, picking them up. <clears throat> oh. <sighs> All right, have another 30 second breather. Oh. 
get angry with the weights, really get them up, but just control them. Don't drop them down, don't get them drop down and pump them out. Like, control the move, press out. Good form, here we go. Three, two, one. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's go, 45 degrees, remember? One. In on the chest, press up. Two. Three. This is the last one for me. That's all I'm getting out there, six. No chance. Might have done seven with a spot, but risky business. I'm trying to do that on my own. Still happy with that, still a good set. One more set on that. I'm going to stretch my pecs, but this is put your arm on the bench. And push down into your, into your chest. I've definitely lifted heavy throughout the month. I didn't start on 30, I can't remember what I started on, but I can feel the, the strength gains, they come quick, like the first few weeks of getting into it, but obviously you can't just continually lift, lift more and more and more. You end up hitting a bit of a plateau. That's when I start to just do slightly more reps or slow the reps down a bit. <clears throat> but yeah, the first few weeks of getting into strength training, if you're new to it, you really will feel yourself improve a lot. Right, so I've done eight reps, then six. I'm gonna try and hit six again on the last set. So eight, six, six. Right, let's go for these press-ups. Last set. Oh, let's go. One. Oof. Two. Three. Four. Slow reps. Five. Six. <clears throat> Seven. Eight. Two more. Nine. That's why I need to your chest off. Right, I'm going to need a bit of a long rest now. I won't get them up, no chance. Let's have a little 30 second breather. So next up we're going to do some elevated, like incline press ups. So we're going to have our hands on the bench like this. Bit of an incline, and then we will then we'll do some flies. Right, <clears throat> this is the last set of this heavy weight now. So I want to do six reps. I can do six reps. I can do six reps. Let's do this. <sighs> right, six strong reps to finish. This is about strength now. I can't stop on four or five. Got to get that last rep. Okay, three, two, one, let's go. All right, here we go, six reps. We got this, come on. Big push up, let's go. One. Two. Three, halfway. Four, ah, five, last rep. Six, six, on the thirties. Thirty large, the big boys. Get up there, boy. Okay, so now I'm gonna go for 10 like elevated push-ups. So we're gonna have 
hands on the bench or step work you might be using. And from there, same thing we're going to do. 10 of them. Then lay flat on my back with the middle size weights. I'm going to do 10. Big stretches, open up the chest. So slight bend in the elbow. Squeeze those pecs, squeeze them back together. Oh. This is our last our chest and our chest exercise. Then we're going to go into two, two exercises, both on the shoulders. So we're going to go for 10 presses again. You can go narrow if you want like this, or you can go a bit wider, wherever you want to just get your hands just for the angle on the stay like this. I'm going to have my feet here. <clears throat> 10, 10 push ups, keeping that nice straight line between the shoulders and the feet. Abs tight. Drop down, let's go 10 reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last rep. Oh. Okay, well, I feel nice and light now after the photos, right? So we're now going to go for 10. Really nice stretch of the pecs. Open up, pec, fly, squeeze together. Ready? Just go straight into it. Oh. Again, in line with the chest. Slight bend in the, in the elbows. Stretch open. Squeeze in. Good. One. Two, three, four, slow controlled reps, five, oh, let's have a break, five, okay, come on, load the chest again, load the chest, six, Last two. Ah, nine. Final rep. Stretch and pull. Good weight, that. Very good weight. Well done. So remember, it's all about control. Feel the stretch. Squeeze back and almost get those dumbbells like squeeze them together and you feel it. Oh, chest is activated. As you squeeze at the end. All right, two more then. Two more like yes, have a quick drink. You don't need a long time. You're just gonna you're just focus on one muscle group like this. You don't need loads of sets, this is enough. With the right weight, it feels really intense. Four. 
much easier. But when you keep it in line with your chest and you squeeze from there like so the dumbbell's finished just above the chest, you feel it way more than when they're up there like that. So find the harder fruit, find the find the stretch and feel feel the muscle work then squeeze out and contract. Oh, shoulders are real life aren't they after this? Because they are linked, you are using your shoulders a little bit through this exercise, but try and take that away and really focus on the pecs. <clears throat> right, we've got one more set, then it's the two sets on the shoulders. Two exercises, two exercises on the shoulders. <sighs> right, you ready? Here we go. 10 push ups, you can go on the bench, whatever you want, incline. You can put your hands wherever you fancy, just keep that back nice and straight, engage the core. <clears throat> and let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Chest is done. Seven, eight, two more, nine, last rep, squeeze at the top, squeeze it together, ah, ah, oh, it's a bar burner, this is pumped, absolutely pumped, okay, last set of the flies, again if you need to drop the weight that's fine, but you should be feeling a stretch through here, through your pec, and squeeze and feel that pump up. Okay. Right, out we go. Oh, I'm tired now, chest is tired. Okay, here we go. 10 reps. Stretch open the pecs and squeeze back in, slap in the elbow. One, two, Three, four, five, six. Oh, give them to have a break. Six, four more. Seven, four. Seated, oh, shoulder press into some lateral rest. We need the sort of mediums and the lights to do that exercise. Oh, it's really got the chest going that one there. 
Let's have a little minute break. If you want to, you can pop your bench up if you've got, if you've got a bench like that. If not, you can still do it flat. I'll do it flat as well, but it just takes a bit more core strength. Okay, I don't know about these 16s, but I'm gonna give them a go. I can do eight, I'll be happy. Let's go eight to 10 reps, followed by some dumbbell lateral raise with the lighter ones, yeah? Right, can we do this? Can we do this? Here we go. Okay. Too heavy, hang on. I might have to do them standing. I can do them standing with the bounce. Right, one, two, three, four, five, go for six. Six. Yeah, a little bit of a push press for me there is. I can't do any strict. I need a 14s really. Okay, now I'm gonna go for lateral shoulder raise. Are you ready? 10 to 12, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, ah, six, seven, eight, ah, two more, nine, Oh, a bit of one, I'm sure I think. Even there too hard. So I could rather move through the weights, even if it's a tiny bit of progression, just do less reps, but that is hard. I can't really see. I can probably do them in my back support, but I'm not sure that. I'll try my second sit like that. It'll be a bit easier to push through the back. Oh. Oh. Right, two more sets. I might spin this round. Ready for the 16s, I'm not even in the middle. Okay, so second set. Oh, shoulder knackered. Right, can I do them seated? Should be able to do a couple extra. Okay, second set. We're doing three sets on this one. Let's go, that's better. One, two, three. Come on, strong shoulders. Four, five. Let's go for eight. Six, seven, last rep. Okay, lateral shoulder raise. Down for 10 again. Ready? Lighter weights. Let's see. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Uh, seven. Eight. Nine. Last rep. Oh. Killer. Oh, 
One more set. We've got a final move, which is going to be a frontal raise. With the light dumbbells. Going. So frontal raise, like back in there. Anterior up out of the shoulder. Oh. Good session, well done. Remember, it's not about doing the same weights as me, it's about you just progressing with your weights each week, each month, coming back if you want to try it again. Maybe stick another kilo on top, or can you do one extra rep? That's progression, right? So progression can come from more weight, or an extra rep, or slowing it down. It hasn't got to always be weight, 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 because it comes a point where you can't continually lift heavier and heavier month on month. You will hit a plateau, but focus on reps, or controlling things a bit, and like, you know, rest pause, right? so you come down, pause for a second, one, two, three, and up. You can take a lighter weight and make it much heavier by doing things like that. Okay, third set. Third and final set. We want eight. Shoulder press, if you can go for 10, go for 10. The aim for you really is just to be burning out on the last couple of reps. So if you're getting to eight, then I've got a couple more. Do a couple more, and that means your weight will go a bit further. A few extra reps. Okay, right, I want eight. Eight absolute belters here. Eight belters. Okay. Right, you ready? Let's go, press. Okay, one. Two. Three. Four. Come on. Five. Six. Last two that count now, come on. Seven. Five's the final round. Oh, that's a worth that one. Proper. Oh, I really like to work with that. That's strength, that's strength training. That is it. Okay, ready? Ten, shoulder raise. Let's go lift. One, two, three, four. Oh, these are heavy as well. Five, six, last set. Seven, eight, two more. Uh, nine, last rep. Uh, relax. Oh. I'm going to have a one minute break. And we're going to finish our final exercise. Which is going to be frontal raise. Really sitting or standing. Let's see that S. Up. So we're raising it out to the front. One set. We're going to go for 12 reps. So 24 in total, yeah? Oh. Yeah, we've hit it. We've hit it hard again. Mate, it's been amazing. This challenge has been great. If I didn't set this challenge, no way would I train in the baby room. It's been tough. Because I used to get a good night's sleep. I love my sleep, I really do, but yeah, she wakes up every sort of three hours. So we're waking, waking up at least two or three times a night. But this makes me feel better. Even though I'm tired, I feel like, I feel so much better for doing a bit of exercise. It sort of releases that stress and frustration from not getting a good night's sleep. So always, always think about that. If you've had a bad night's sleep, you've had a stressful day, like do some exercise, move your body, throw some weights about, you release it, you release that energy. Right. Here we go, so it's 12 reps per side, 24 in total, coming out to the front, let's go. One, two on the stand, <clears throat> three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last set, last exercise, 11, it's one set of these. 13, 14, uh, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Last four reps. 21, 
22, two more, 23, final rep to finish, 24, and relax, oh, chest and shoulders, smashed, completed, well done, that's day number 20, come back tomorrow because day number 21 is the final day, it's my birthday, I'm going to film it on my birthday in the morning, and it's going to be a full body strength session, so everything, chest, shoulders, back, legs, arms, abs, it's going to be a great workout, a bumper, bonanza, full body strength training session. So thanks again for tuning in. Hit subscribe to The Body Coach TV. I post loads of regular workouts on here. Um, and you can also check out The Body Coach app on the App Store and uh, Google Play. Have a lovely day and I'll see you tomorrow where I'll turn 37 on the 21st September and it's going to be a big, big birthday workout. See you there.